Hi, my name is Faisal Khan. I'm a master Salesforce trainer here in Quality Thought. And now today we're going to discuss about Salesforce course. For example, here you want to learn a Salesforce course and what all the content that you want, what is the required content which can make you get in, into the industry, which can take you to the job, job opportunities and all. So let's see the content first. So first thing first is the data. Salesforce is a massive storage of data and here uh, we generate this content in terms of data and data analysis, data uh, migrations, data management, etc, etc. So first thing we design the data storages like objects, applications, fields, etc, etc. And then we'll take this data to the data management, data you know, data handling, data migrations, data analysis, etc, etc. And this, you see, uh, this data analysis will be done in the reports as well as the dashboards. Salesforce also includes this AI and Salesforce also includes this, uh, the data uh, representations and the data uh, management and all. So here, here we are talking about the data migrations and the data analysis so here salesforce own tableau now and we know the tableau is the data visualization tool right and here we can design those dashboards we can design those massive uh, reports in our salesforce environment and that what we cover and all and then uh, you see apart from that uh, we also have the automations let's say uh, if a customers if a customers want to uh, take the product okay when the customer buy the product our email should be went automatically I notification should be sent automatically this can possible with the Salesforce automations and we cover the Salesforce automations the advanced automation like flows the process builders etc etc and apart from that uh, we also do the data validations where we check the proper data we pa we make sure ke, uh, we pass the proper data into the database and apart from that we also covers uh, this advanced topics like Salesforce securities where we again you see everything links up the data. So here we make sure that proper data is visible to the proper employees, proper users and all. And in to make sure that uh, the data is visible to the proper user and uh, <coughs> respective users, we do the data securities and all. And we cover these things. Apart from these, we also uh, into the developments and we are also into the deployments where, uh, you know, we have the sandboxes, we have the productions where we develop the features, everything in the sandbox and then we'll deploy it to the production. This entire life cycle of this uh, Salesforce or uh, entire life cycle of a software component will be covered in the course. Apart from that, uh, we also cover the customization part. For example, uh, you take LWC or you take the programming language like Apex. And here we cover from scratch to the advanced level. And here the very basic, we start with the data types. Then we go for the Apex classes, Apex triggers. Then we also cover asynchronous Apex. Then we also cover the integration part as well. So that's how we start. We start with the data type and we end with the integration. Now, apart from these things, uh, now comes the LWC part where we design the web pages and we covered very basics to the advanced concepts of LWCs. Now, apart from these things, you see, we also include AI in Salesforce, right? We also teach you the Salesforce AI. Now, let's discuss how this AI implements on Salesforce, how AI affects the Salesforce. So just Im just imagine someone is telling you ke, uh, which which area to target. Someone is telling uh, a company who to target, like who are the audience to whom you can sell your product. Just imagine someone is guiding you ke, where in which area you can sell your product. Okay, how much quantity of product you can sell, how the quality of product should be and next two, three months, how the sales are going to be and what were the sales of the previous month. You see, this, these all things are human needs uh, and the human intelligence things will be uh, done, will be processed with the help of Salesforce AI. Now, 
uh, apart from this salesforce also encourage salesforce ai also to be in the service terms for service terms in the sense how to help the customer solving their issues how to help the customer uh, retargeting how to help the customer rebuilding their uh, connections and how to connect with the customers at the right time right place and the right platform and this all will be implemented from the salesforce ai and again salesforce ai is actually a paid thing and uh, we are fortunate enough to get you trained on salesforce ai apart from this you see now salesforce is also uh, integrated with aws gcp and devops now we are fortunate enough to come up with a content where we are delivering the salesforce devops connectivity and how the salesforce and the devops are integrated okay and uh, as if now just to be uh, you know clear salesforce helps uh, salesforce devops helps in the component building and component debugging for example if you uh, write down a piece of code and you want to deploy it deploy it to the production salesforce devops will help you reducing your efforts by debugging it continuously and uh, uh, deploying it continuously integrating it continuously and all so that's how salesforce devops works salesforce ai works salesforce data works salesforce automation works salesforce programming works so everything is clear everything will be uh, trained from scratch to the advanced level so we are going to cover each and every module right from the basics to the advanced including the advanced concept which will help you getting into the industry which help you landing on your dream job for sure so that's all about uh, today's session we'll see you in the next video thank you